it was the most beautiful thing I'd ever seen. Looking out 360 degrees, as far as you can see, not a speck of humanity, not a single imprint, footprint of humanity, not a road, not a cabin, nothing, okay? That's how remote we were. Two weeks hike to the nearest town, walking every, hiking every day. Where, where, where is this, by the Southern way? Southern Utah. Got it. You're yeah. so remote, dude. You're, if you hike, you gotta hike, you gotta walk every day for two weeks before you get to the nearest town. That's how remote you are. So I'm looking around and I'm so overcome by emotion, dude. It felt like I was touched by the hand of God. It was like at that, at that moment, God revealed himself to me. All that anger and that hate and that, and that resentment flipped, it inverted to just infinite like hope, gratitude, peace, love. It just flipped on a dime like that. And I was so overcome by emotion. I just sat at the edge of that, at, of, that, of that cliff and I wept. I wept for an hour, uncontrollable weeping, but tears of joy. Yeah, yeah, of course. Tears of joy, but tears of everything, feeling every emotion at once, all the pain and all the Connectivity, joy. the ultimate connected feeling. Everything. Have you ever have you ever taken a uh, psychedelic before? Yes. Do, have you ever had that experience on psychedelics? Any experience I've had on psychedelics doesn't even come got close it, to this. Got it, got it. Doesn't even come close got to it. this. And it was at that moment, that was the birth of my spiritual life. That was, the, wow. that, that was where I was overcome and I, I knew, uh, okay, no, there is something else out there, okay? There is a higher power, wow. there is higher intelligence. Because it felt like it had just tapped me on the shoulder.